Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Hello, hello. It is Mr. Shine. I just went in um, from the church. I'm back. I'm playing some more Amnesia, a machine for pigs. Um, I ran from a pig monster creature thing. That's where I ended last time. Um, and now I'm in some sketchy ass church. Of course, always some sort of door open. Oh, a couple. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, hopefully you guys can see all right. Uh, what do I have in terms of my... Oh, that's right. I'm inside St. Dunstan's. Mr. Dunstan is here to see you now. Hmm. All right. Well, hopefully you guys can see this all right. It's a pretty big church. There's the crest. The um, the mighty Dunstan eagle pooping a little golden feather. I used to play for the Dunstan Golden Eagles. They had a killer lacrosse team. <laughs> a killer. They were to die. Sorry, I thought I saw something over there. I think it was just. Of course. Of course the church will have some sort of great organ playing. Mmm. Yes, this is my church. I am St. Dunstan. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh. That's a pig. Who's playing the organ back there? Those pigs? Is that a pig? There's a candle missing. Oh. What does that do? A cryptic clue. Some kind of mechanism. A secret and infernal one, no doubt. The missing candlestick is clearly the answer. But why this, I cannot fathom. Why hide secret machines in the place of prayer? And where are the faithful? Why are there drag marks about the altar as if someone was pulled away? Good question. Didn't realize there were drag marks, but I apparently need a candle. The quest for the candle. Can I take that? Oh, I can start them. Hmm, those are my prayers. Drag marks? Oh. Obviously. Oh. I was gonna say maybe it opens up or something. I'll just light all these candles. Oh, grody. Okay. Can I take that candle? No. So some weird machine, okay. A shovel that I cannot, wait, can I move it? Oops. I like how I've just totally, occasionally just like hit the edges. Okay. Well, um, so I need a stupid ass candle. A goddamn stupid ass candle. Even though there's a bunch of candles all over the goddamn place, I need to use like the right candle. Don't worry though, I can light every other goddamn candle in this goddamn place. I shouldn't be saying goddamn so much. I'm in a church. The church of pigs. Oh, he has like a dead pig underneath him. Did I make this place? What is that? Oh, it's just like a low. Like, why is this place so pig-oriented? I just don't really get it. I guess I just don't understand, man. Is that a candle? No, that's just a Bible. Is that the Biblia? It is. It is the Biblia. Should I just check through every 
Got every blessed pew. Every blasted pew for some sort of clue or candle. Oh, this guy was reading a ton of books. Do, 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 do. Every now and then I hear something and it's a little spooky. Who left a bear? Why? Why a bear? Who brings a bear to church? I mean, also, if you're gonna go to this church, why don't you bring a pig? Why wouldn't you just bring a pig to church? Why did the organ stop playing? What was that? Can I, should I keep going? Should I just keep asking questions? Because when I just keep hearing the same oppressive sound effects, it freaks me out a little bit. This is Mr. Shine quest for the missing candle. Oh, is that a pig? All right, I heard another thing. Just a little spooky. Hello, lady. Oh, it's like a pig person. Am I a pig? Is that the great M. Night Shyamalan twist that I've been a pig this whole time? You've been a pig, Mandus. The whole goddamn time you've been a pig. It's the humans that are the beasts. Yes, it has to keep being spooky. Spooky, spooky, spooky. It's still oppressive. Hello. Let me just close these doors. Who would be screaming at this hour? Is it the lady who lost her... Oh, wait. Wait, wait, is this... Nope. Did not find a secret taped candle to my chair. Ooh. Father Jeremiah's journal. They flock to us now, where once I had to walk amongst them to bring salvation into their lives. Now, drawn by warmth and winter, by the food that Mandis distributes, that's me. My church is full and my charges are saved. He walks amongst them and they almost worship him. He will not allow them to work in his factories, claiming that his workforce are especially trained for the new machinery he uses and that it would be irresponsible, nay, unethical to risk such precious lives as he sees here. A changed man since Mexico, it is said to be praised in the face of such appalling tragedy and from the confines of his sickbed as he is often chained to he conducts one of the greatest and most benevolent charities in all of london not content with the rise to become the dominant food produce business in the land he distributes his goodwill his fares to the poor and they congregate about his kingdom in gratitude oh i am a benevolent man the church loves me the church of the swine swine oh of course so now when i grab this stupid candle i'm gonna get freaked the hell out because something's going to chase me because that's how this stupid game works. Stupid game. Should I start by going opening this door? Because I'm going to have to start being chased by some stupid pig beast. Can I turn that candle? No. I cannot. Alright. Well, let's do this. Here we go. Here it comes. I mean, something's going to be spooky, right? Spooky, 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 spooky. I'm spooking myself just by talking about spookiness. Spooky, spooky, spooky. I heard spooky. This door? No. This thing over here? Huh. Infernal machinery. The engine fires. The flames are stoked. I hear steam in the wells. Vibration upon the very air. My heart falters at the prospect of throwing the lever and exposing the workings of this dark contraption. But my children beckon me, and I cannot fail them. No, I cannot. Okay. Another map thing. A hellish portal? It appears I have no choice thus I descend, and may God have mercy on my soul. 
This is my bedlam, and I am to be cast as Matthews, and I will wear the mantle for the sake of the bu boys and face whatever horrors lie beneath the altar. Okay, so I go to the altar. Thanks for telling me. Ooh. Oh. So weird. I opened that to turn that fire on to go down here. Why didn't I just light a flame? I had all those other candles. I could have just started a blaze. I didn't need to do all this. Did I? Doesn't make any sense. <laughs> what happened? Oh, it locked me down here. Well, now the only way I can go is forward. Into the machine, the end final contraption. I got an itchy back. Oh, that back is itchy. All right, what's under this? A cat. Sounds like a baby. Sounds do not startle or upset the acquisitions. Oh shit. Oh shit. Listen, Papa. Hold the egg to your ear. You can hear the sea. The sea, eh? So I'm in some sort of underground cage dungeon. Did you hear that? What am I saying? Of course you hear that. Oh, fuck. What was that? Oh, Christ almighty. Gracious love of God. Jesus, Jeebus. Eagles, golden eagles of Dunstan, save me. Just like the cross of yore. Uh... These final thoughts. What exhumation is this? What rotten fruit? What be stitching of parts? Ooh. I doubt I will ever be found. Yet I leave you this, scrawled in the maldurious half-light, whilst my tormentor shuffles below my fellow prisoners keen and squeal in the gloam, and where I wait for the knocking upon my cage that signifies it is finally my turn to make that dark journey into the interior. <clears throat> okay. Thanks, dudes. Why does this game have to be spooky? Why can't it be just like friendly? Yeah, 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 the acquisitions. One of these stupid cages is gonna rattle or something. I know it is. Keep expecting spookiness, that's the thing. When you expect spookiness and don't get it. Dead rats. You just get like extra spooks. <laughs> Fucking mother of Hey, Mandus? Oh, that's me. I mean, I'm Enoch. That's not Anduin or Enoch. It's definitely not one of them. Okay, I'm coming. I'll let you out, strange Latin speaking gentleman. Fuck. Oh, fucking mother of Jesus, mother of mercy, Mary. That was a pig beast, right? Just a pig beast running. Why didn't it. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. So boned, aren't I? Why is <sighs> Okay. 
Okay, 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 okay. I mean, there's one in here, right? Oh my god, oh my god. Uh, this just seems like there's so much. Okay. Where's Mr. Latin Man? Mr. Latin Man. Mr. Latin Man. Oh, no, there's a sobbing lady. Why? Why am I going this way? That's where Evil Pig Beast was. Maybe he's not evil. Maybe he's just a nice pig beast. Hey, nice pig beast. Are you my pet? Oh, fucking mother, fucking mother, fucking. Do you see that? It's coming this way. Oh no, oh no. You did see that, right? It's behind me. Oh fuck, oh mother fuck. And so to the stoking, pulling cogwheels now sneeze into his kerchief when the dust got into his eyes. I have begun to change more rapidly now, he surmised. <sighs> so I hope you guys could see that okay, but there I definitely had to juke a pig beast. A pig beast definitely was there. And definitely needed to be dealt with which means I I am now at the point where I'm going to die by pig beast death by pig beast is in inevitability inevitable humility let's just keep that door closed so pig beast can't get me and let's cover this so pig beast can't go through said door of course Okay, did it say anything about... Oh no, I didn't see, okay. I, I like how Mandus talks a whole bunch, but then as soon as he actually sees the pig beast, he doesn't spend the time to write anything down. Speaking of pigs... Mm. Mm, mm, mm. All right. Um, another truck fueling station. At least I'm outside. Thank God. Like, I'm not as horribly terrified outside. I'm getting some frame drops. That's great. Meh. Oh, can I do some mad hops here? Hang on a second. Oh. Mm. 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 Check this out. Mm. No, it didn't. It's not going to work. Jesus, you stupid crows. I'm gonna shoot you all. Where did these come from? 
What? Please, always here? Did I just imagine this? Did the crow throw barrels down? Why are these here? I bet I can't move this stupid truck. Oh, I don't even need to. Okay. So I'm past that facility into some other facility. Of course, it's been nighttime forever. Mandisco Meat Processing Factory. Established 18, 1828 Mandisco. Mm. Mandis, as in eats man. Water in his shoes. Well, always the water and the sparks of the embers of the wheels. It's too bony. It's too damn bony. What's bony? Mandis meat. Mmm. Mandis meat. Oh, I can't spin these. That's too bony. All right, let's read my article. The Mandis Processing Company. My soul shudders at what I've seen, but at last I have reached the main part of the factory. Now onwards, downwards to find these floodwaters and drain them away. Like muses, I will cleave the waters and lift my little darlings clear of its vile cradle. Okay, weirdo. Such a stupid weirdo. Mandis, you're such a goddamn idiot. I can say goddamn now that I'm out of the church. Why are these lights on? Why is there a light right there? It's like the junk light. You just open up the window, it's like, bam! Mandis' is junk right in your face. I mean, why? who would want that, such a thing? Not me. That's for damn sure. Hmm. Peak. <laughs> okay. Yep, that's the place, alright. Is this... Okay, so... I'm getting so pedantic. Strangers not allowed in this works. Inquiries to be made at the, the, the lodge. And Mendes meet. Mm -mm -mm. So much Mendes meat. I'll show you some Mendes meat. Hey, hey. Hey, oh. <laughs> what the hell am I? What the hell's going on? Why am I talking? I'm talking because I'm scared. That's really why. Hmm. Let's just keep those closed, shall we? Can I do that? I can't push them all the way. Whatever. Okay. I have infiltrated Mandis Meat Co. Yes. Oh. These men, Professor, these so-called men of vision, they would shackle the masses to a wheel and turn it till their backs break. All for that opiate, the lure of profit. These fools who lackey them, these priests, these officials, this government, they make pigs of us all. But what solution, my dear man? How to break a cycle? You cannot simply remove the promise of a better world for these unfortunates. In the workhouses, in the orphanages, the belief in heaven is surely the only sucker one can find. We do not need to wait. We can bring forth paradise now. We can speed the passion. With only a small sacrifice, we can hold the apocalypse. With mm. just a small sacrifice, we can free our shackles and deliver them to paradise now. I don't know what you're talking about. Is paradise just like the freedom from... I don't know. Flood breach, emergency shutdown in place. Yeah, I know that already. Okay, this is going to make some sort of weird noise when I go underneath it. I am... Piston rooms. You go into the Mandis meat packing and boom, you're in piston rooms. Who made this layout? Who's the horrible... Oh. 
Why? Stop! Oh my god. Oh fuck. There's something over there. <sighs> okay. I'm I'm gonna get eaten. Oh god damn it. God damn it. I'm trapped. I'm trapped with the pig beasts. And my stupid meat co. My meat co. You brutes. This is my meat co. You brutes. I have a pliers. I have a pliers. So many moving things. Ugh, Jesus Christ, okay. Every part of me itches apparently when I'm scared. Stop! Why does it do that? I keep expecting horrors. Alright, do I go down or up? Let's go up. So we can go down. Right, because eventually I want to go down, but I want to start going up. Hello? Is someone there? Is Ugh. Okay, hang on one second. Yes, yes, I'm busy. What is it? Amanda speaking. I am compromised. Our contacts must be brief and occasional. Beware the wretches who populate this compound. The way you seek is under the pistons. When you meet the saboteur, you will understand everything. <laughs> Beware the wretches. So there will be wretches. I mean, I kind of knew that, I guess. This whole time I was preparing for the blotchy wretches. Um, can I get out this door or is it going to be locked? Of course, it's going to be locked. So someone is driving away with my meat. Someone's stealing my meat. Getting out of dodge. Like, why would I want to go down here? I have to be where wretches. Is there a wretch? I'm scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm in the piston room. Is that going to be... It's probably too dark for all y'all. But I'm in a strange piston looking room. Oh.
you know what? Let's save this for another time. Uh, that's been about a half an hour. I'm sufficiently freaked, and I'm going to go into a real uh, spooky-ass room with spooky-ass sound. So, um, there we go. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I'll see you later. Bye.